Aloha kakahiaka means good morning to you. Aloha kakahiaka, ohayo gozaimasu. Zao shang hao and good morning to my jams and jellies. Today we are going to be building a Daiso Petite Block Maltese Dog and it is from the series Friends of Dogs and Cats. This is the number five out of the series. So without further ado, let's get into this dog. So today we are going to be building the Maltese breed. I personally am not aware of this breed. However, they seem to be a very cute and very small breed and they apparently seem to be very popular in dog shows. So today I'm going to be telling you some facts about the Maltese breed. As I previously stated, the Maltese dog breed is often seen featured in dog shows as one of the very top competitors. The Maltese is known for its beautiful, long white fur, playful and affectionate personality, and many other features and traits that it exhibits on a daily basis. The Maltese are often known for being fearless. They are always on the go, always energetic, and always eager to meet new people and discover new things. Oddly enough, although the Maltese has a long silky white coat, they are actually hypoallergenic, which means that you can bring them home if you are allergic to dog dandruff and fur. Another fun fact about the Maltese is that they typically don't shed. Because the Maltese dog breed is fearless, they also love to explore and discover. With their intense energy, they have an agile physique and it allows them to be excellent jumpers in general. Because the Maltese are so small and so cute, they actually often get the haircut called the puppy cut, which helps them look like permanent puppies and I think that is absolutely adorable. As the Maltese are hypoallergenic, they do not have an undercoat, which is also part of the reason why they do not shed. However, because they do not have an undercoat of fur, they can easily sunburn because their pale skin is lying very shortly beneath their shimmering white fur coat. The Maltese are excellent with children and other animals because they have a very sweet personality and they are very sociable. A fun fact that I did not know is that because the Maltese is a breed that is very affectionate, they are often used as therapy dogs. However, like most dogs, they do suffer from their own health problems. The Maltese suffer from tear staining, which is when the fur near their eyes is often stained because of their supposed tears that run like Makapia Pier or eye rubbish. They are also susceptible to dental problems like many other small dogs do. Like most dogs, often common in very large dogs, they need to release their energy or else they can become very aggressive. However, despite that, they would not make very good guard dogs because of how sociable and fearless they are.
I absolutely love how this Maltese came out and I think that the bows on its ears are absolutely adorable. I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Like the video if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it, consider subscribing, being part of the pantry, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Let me know in the comments down below what you would like to see from me next. My name is Jelly Jamie Jam and I will see you in the next video. Mahalo and ahui ho!